I'm Yuki Washington with your evening digital news brief for Friday, July 22nd. It's day five of a stifling heat wave, and the region has its first heat related death. A 73 year old man in Allentown who had underlying health conditions died yesterday. And doctors are worried that there could be more health issues in the next few days. Highs will be 95 to 100 degrees this weekend. Doctors say in addition to self care, you need to please check on older relatives. The McVeigh Rec Center is shut down for the summer after a violent attack yesterday. Five staff members at the pool were assaulted after they told three females, possibly teenagers, to leave. Police say the situation escalated. The workers were punched and three cars were vandalized outside. The McVeigh pool has been drained and will stay closed. Activists plan to shut down Sesame Place tomorrow at noon. It's in response to a viral video which a family says shows a costume character ignoring two black girls. Organizers are not saying how they plan to shut down the Langhorne Park. We reached out to Sesame Place and the Langhorne Police Department for comments, but have yet to hear back. The Eagles unveiled their new black helmets this afternoon. The birds will wear the helmets with their black jerseys throughout the season. We're doing parts of the season anyway. That was Devontae Smith modeling the new headwear. Let us know what you think of the helmets on social media. We're at CBS Philly. Remember, you can always get the latest on these stories and much more right here at CBSPhilly.com. That is the latest for the Evening Digital Brief. I'm Yuki Washington.